So I made an oversized Day of the Dead flower crown style headpiece for my Halloween costume this year. And I got five silk roses, three of them were large and two of them were smaller, and a headband from the craft store. I got a thin metal one so I could put some bobby pins through it if it ends up being too heavy. I also got black ribbon to cover up the back, used my glue gun, and some black felt. And basically the pin for this actually loops back to a thread banger video on YouTube. So if this video isn't very adequate in <laughs> showing you how to make this, you can actually find that link below and see Corinne's awesome video on how she made hers. Basically, I did three oversized flowers for the center of mine because I wanted it to be super dramatic looking and oversized, but um, all you do is pop the flowers off the stems and what I'm doing there is adding glue to the back of them so they don't fall apart, gluing a strip of felt onto the headband to secure the flowers too with hot glue, and then covering up the back side of the flowers with a piece of felt and that really thick black ribbon so that it looks nice and fancy from all angles and all sides. I'm really pleased with how it turned out. And what's really nice about this is if you wanted to make some of these for more like everyday wear or for a young girl, you could just get smaller flowers and then you don't really have to use the big felt strips or the ribbon or anything to cover up the back. So that's also shown in that video that I'll link below. And I uh, hope that if you do make something like this that you send me pictures of it or you send me a link to a video of your own because I think it's a really gorgeous thing once it's all put together and I'd like to see what everybody else's turn out to look like. Now here what I did was I folded over the edge and glued down on the cut edge of the ribbon and then I just sort of glued back and forth in kind of a folded pattern, nothing too calculated or specific, just to make it look really nice and keep it sturdy on the back and cover up all the back sides of the flowers. And there it is. Thanks guys. Bye.